Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Homeland Security boss announces border ultimatum that sends undocumented fleeing. The controversy surrounding immigration issues at the border has been escalating over the past few weeks. President Trump, Press Secretary Sarah Huckabee Sanders, and Kirsten Nielsen have been going overboard giving press statements, press releases, and speaking with the public and other agencies on this ongoing issue. But it is Secretary Nielsen that has been getting the brunt of the criticism as head of the Department of Homeland Security. It has only gotten progressively worse. And it will continue to go on so long as the press allows this type of behavior to continue. The Patriot Journal reported. Secretary of Homeland Security Kirsten Nielsen isn't backing down. In the face of constant attacks by the left, the DHS boss echoes President Trump's strong stance on illegal immigration, and doesn't care who she offends. During a speech at a law enforcement conference on Monday, Nielsen was quick to fire back at the border control critics. We have to do our job, stated Nielsen. We will not apologize for doing our job. We have sworn to do this job. This administration has a simple message. In response to those who claim DHS is keeping kids in cages, Nielsen clarified that situation with the truth, something liberals have no interest in. But here it is, it is important to note that these minors are very well taken care of. Don't believe the press. They are very well taken care of. You know this, as many of you have detention facilities of your own. We operate according to some of the highest standards in the country. We provide food, medical, education, and all needs that the child requests. All of this is true, so don't listen to the endless liberal propaganda the mainstream media shoves down our throats. And finally, Nielsen punctuated her speech with several powerful statements that really resonated with patriotic American citizens, if you cross the border illegally, we will prosecute you. If you make a false immigration claim, we will prosecute you. If you smuggle illegal aliens across an extraordinarily dangerous journey, we will prosecute you. Thank you for saying it. However, all the answers she has been providing is not enough and people have chosen to protest her agency as well as her home in retaliation. The Washington Post reported. About two dozen people gathered Friday morning outside the Virginia home of Homeland Security Secretary Kirsten Nielsen in response to the Trump administration's policy on separating children from their parents at the border. According to an organizer of the protest, Nielsen was seen leaving through the back door of the home, in Alexandria, as the protest wound down around 8.30 a.m. It lasted about an hour. On Tuesday, she was heckled by protesters at a Mexican restaurant that is two blocks from the White House. Nielsen has become the face of President Trump's family separation policy, which he halted in an executive order Wednesday. At least 2,500 immigrant children have been separated from their families over the past six weeks at the border. Secretary Nielsen made it clear with her ultimatum. If you truly are coming to the United States for the right reasons to seek asylum and escape persecution then there is no reason to illegally cross. We have the resources to take care of and accept migrants who are fleeing persecution. But if they do not come here the right way then we cannot help them the way we could have if they were honest with us from the very beginning. This administration is compassionate but it also has limits. Unlike Democrats, we understand that there are limits to what we are capable of doing and we cannot pay for everything because that is not the way the world works. No amount of protesting will change that fact and no amount of vitriol that is spewed at her will change that either. Nielsen is following the law and instructing her staff and officers to do the same. Furthermore, she is following the instructions of the current White House administration. There is no shame in that, she should be proud of it. She is absolutely correct, the mainstream media is not reporting on the facts as these kids are given impeccable care upon their arrival. We are one of the most generous countries in the entire world yet some within our country do not recognize it and instead try to demonize members of this administration for their actions. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click, like, and subscribe. Thank you.